High school football teams across the region are gearing up for this year's season, and I know we are here at 41-2. Today, Fox Sports 1670's Bill Shanks is in with FPD's coach, Greg Moore. It's year three for the FPD Vikings and the Georgia High School Association, and so far so good, 15 and eight in their first 23 games, first two seasons. Greg Moore, the head coach of the Vikings, joins us here in the coach's corner. Uh, you know, I think it's safe to, to have a little evaluation after a couple of years. Uh, how do you think and, and everything you expected it to be? Oh, well, it has been, and the, the kids love it, and that's the most important thing. You know, we felt like it was a good move uh, for our school and for our kids and all the things involved in trying to have an extracurricular program, and, you know, that goes beyond just football. There are a lot of things to take into consideration. And, sure. Um, everybody on the staff and administration was on board, and, and um, our school family and our kids have responded, and it's been a great experience. And in terms purely of football, uh, you know, it's just been uh, very positive, very tough, mm -hmm. uh, a lot to learn uh, for us as a coaching staff and a lot for our kids to learn along the way. But it's been great, and uh, I'm very pleased with where we are right now. And a playoff win last year, I mean, that's a good step forward, right? It's a great step. You know, we wanted to get in the playoffs and, mm -hmm. and we did it and then we wanted to win in the playoffs and we did it and so uh, maybe we need to get a little bit more specific in how far <laughs> we want to go in that thing. Well and the competitive nature of you and your coaching staff, your player and your program is to take that next step. Uh, you, you guys scored a lot of points on offense last year, 33 points, but you have a little bit of a battle at quarterback. So that's always going to be a big question mark. Tell us about that competition that will be going on in August. Well, we've got uh, two or three guys that, that uh, kind of have their hat in the ring, so to speak. And, you know, one of them is Will McCormick, and Will has some game experience. He played some last year when Brooks was out a couple of weeks. Mm -hmm. Got some really invaluable experience as a freshman. Uh, Will's just going to be a sophomore. Uh, I've got a young man named Austin Cox, who's a, a rising junior, who um, wants his name in that hat, too. And so we're going to give Austin a chance to – get out there and duke it out with Will a little bit, and, and that's what camp is for. Uh, they're good friends, they're both great kids, and uh, they're both very positive you know, you know, players and, and teammates in our locker room. So mm -hmm. either way it shakes out, we're gonna be in good shape, and uh, both of them will be the better for the competition. But you're right, we've got, a, we've got big shoes to fill at quarterback. Oh, no doubt about that. Well, coming up on our next report, we'll take a look at the defense. A few more returning starters for Greg Moore. We'll talk about that in the upcoming season on our next report. Tonight on the news at 11, we'll hear from Bill and Coach Moore more about the Vikings. And tomorrow at 6, we'll have Coach Vaughn Lassiter from Houston County High.